What we have here on the left is a 1948 RCA model, model 9 T246, and on the right, a GE 1950 model 10 T6. And I wanted to quickly point out some of the big advances that took place within two years. The RCA set on the left has a non-aluminized 10 BP4, as the one on the right has an aluminized 10 FP4A. Both these tubes are interchangeable electrically, but aluminizing the tube or, or, or adding aluminum to it gave it, it was for much, much better brightness. You can get a lot more brightness out of the tube before you overdrove it. Secondly, we had the IF frequency on this set is 22.5 megahertz, and on this one is 45 0.75 megahertz they doubled the frequency and people that understand and know about radio early radio um in the early 1930s they created what was called a super heterodyne and what that did was converted all frequencies to one frequencies well it's the same thing with television the heterodyne frequency by doubling